What is happening everyone? Welcome back to another video in my channel. So today's video will be diving into a quick comparison between the two major cloud platforms, Kamaterra and DigitalOcean. So if you are trying to decide between the two, stick around because Kamaterra might be just what you're looking for. So without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into it. So first off, Kamaterra is all about flexibility. They let you customize your service down to the smallest detail. Whether you are a startup with basic needs or a growing business that requires a ton of computing power, Kamaterra has you covered from one vCPU all the way up to 104 vCPUs. The range is absolutely insane. What makes this even better is how easy it is to scale. With Kamatera, you can add or reduce resources instantly. No need to mess around with resizing servers. DigitalOcean, on the other hand, requires you to resize the droplets, which isn't as smooth. Now let's go ahead and talk about global reach. Kamatera has 24 data centers across North America, Europe, Asia, Australia, and the Middle East. They have recently added Singapore for Tokyo and Australia, which mean you can place your service closer to your customers for better performance. In comparison, DigitalOcean has 15 data centers. So while it's a strong option, Kamatera still offers a broader coverage. And when things go wrong, because we all know they will at some point, Kamatera offers 24 seven dedicated support. You can pick up the phone, shoot them an email or jump on a live chat anytime. DigitalOcean, they do have a tiered support system. So you might not get immediate support unless you paying extra. Now, if you run Windows servers, then Kamatera is the way to go. They support both Linux and Windows, while DigitalOcean sticks to Linux-based systems only. That's a big deal for businesses that need Windows for certain apps. Plus, Kamatera offers flexible pricing. You can choose hourly billing if you are just testing things out, or monthly if you're going long-term. You only pay for what you use, no long-term contracts. DigitalOcean, monthly billing only, which isn't bad, but not as flexible. So, bottom line, if you are after flexibility, global coverage, instant scalability and solid 24 7 support Kamatera takes the win they give you the freedom to build exactly what you need when you need it now digital ocean is a solid choice don't get me wrong but Kamatera just offers more flexibility and control especially for businesses with growing or changing needs so that is pretty much it for the video guys if you did find some value make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and if you want to try Kamatera for yourself I will leave a link in the description to test out a special trial option Offer. Thank you so much for watching guys and until the next one peace